I feel that this work is a direct outgrowth of my last body of work, the One Big Love series, which was my last show. And there were a couple paintings in that show that were shaped sort of like half donuts. And it made it, the paint look like it was kind of draped over some sort of a nail or a hook, a central fulcrum. And I liked that idea of this kind of draping quality, although I was much more interested then in painting as abstraction, whereas here they've evolved more into an interest in that slippery territory between language and abstraction and illusionism. So I've decided to call these paintings paint slash rags as opposed to paint rags to really accentuate that slippery territory. Um, David Pagel, who wrote the essay for my catalog, actually had a great expression for them. He called them category straddling mongrels in love with a kind of fugitive formalism and renegade realism. They are very formal abstractions, in my opinion, and yet they are almost like trompe stand-ins for the real thing. So you don't quite know what you're looking at, and I, I think that's kind of hilarious and funny, and I like this, the fact that they have a sense of humor to them, and yet they're really beautiful objects. In fact, I'm going to quote Richard Moss, who said something uh, wonderful about his own process, which was that beauty is the sharpest tool in the box. And I completely agree with that. So with all the conceptual underpinnings for the work and the formalism, uh, for me, at the end of the day, they, they have to be beautiful. They have to be seductive and they have to draw you in.